Hello! Okay, I have my headphones on because today we're going to be talking about um, stress and one of the best ways to overcome stress is with music. But we're also going to be doing a tapping script on it and I'm actually going to take you outside where the streets of Barcelona are tapping, tapping, <laughs> clapping and see what's on my mind. There's actually more people clapping today than normal. I don't know if you can tell. Um, you can still hear it in the background. Ah, these classes were divinely timed to start right when that is happening. Um, it's really beautiful. It's a really beautiful way for everybody to come together right now and um, just feel like we're a community and adding something positive to the world. So today I thought would be a good day to um, do some tapping for stress. Um, I know that I um, definitely have good days and bad days and just there's so many things that are triggering us that it's really easy to feel stressed all the time. So this is just going to be a really, um, uh, a really sort of light tapping script on the topic of stress. Um, this is something, this is a script and a video that I'd like you to come back to over and over again. So anytime you feel stressed, just watch this video. So, um, if you want the best way to come back and find this video is to click the share button that will post it to your wall. And so you can always go to your wall to find this video. Um, this will definitely be one that you'll want to keep using over and over again. Um, this is a, a tapping script just for sort of generally calming your stress and anxiety. Um, hi, Rosemary. Hi, Valerie. Thanks for being here. Um, and, and yeah, it's, it's, I've been finding it actually really helpful. I typically like to, um, go pretty deep with my, with my tapping and, um, my techniques are usually not script based. Um, but I wrote this one and I'm just finding that for general anxiety, um, because there's so many things that are causing us anxiety right now that this has actually been really, really helpful. So, um, so yeah, so click the share button, share it to your wall. Also give me some hearts and just, um, if you're here live, just type in the chat box and let me know where you're, um, where you're here from. And, uh, so I can see your face and say so and see your name. Um, okay. The other thing that I want to talk about too is, um, is managing stress. I've noticed for me personally, when I, um, when I don't exercise, even though I've been in my house for like 10 days now, there's been a couple days where I haven't done any kind of exercise. And those are usually the days that I feel really, really bad. So, um, if you don't exercise regularly, now is a great time to start. I just do it as soon as you get out of bed, like feet hit the floor, put on your exercise shoes and just go watch a video or do anything. I use an app called the 12 minute athlete. Um, they have 12 minute high intensity trainings in an app that you can use body weight for, or they have a bunch of other things. If you have, um, if you have, if you have, uh, uh, so equipment at home, but you don't need any equipment. This is what I use when I travel because I, you know, if I need to do a workout in my hotel room, it's a kind of an intense workout. So if you don't like that, there's tons of like yoga. There's so many people doing free online classes. There's everything is available on YouTube. I just, I want to encourage you to get into a habit of regularly exercising every single day. It releases your endorphins. It lowers your stress hormones. Um, so many good things are going to come out of exercising regularly. And I noticed that I have a much greater ability to um, stay focused and stay uh, positive. The other thing that I'm using a lot too is music. Um, I put together a couple of playlists that are, um, that just really help me get into my body. So when I'm listening to music, I use my headphones so I can crank it up really, really loud. 
And a lot of the music that I'm listening to is very um, tribal or very uh, bass oriented. When, when I hear bass, deep bass, it grounds me, it gets me into my body, and that actually makes me feel really, really good. So emotional eaters, we tend to like to pop out of our bodies, and when we're stressed, we're kind of like not in our bodies, and we're frantic, and I find that the bass really grounds and centers me. So I'm going to, um, I'll put some links to playlists that I put together. You might love it, you might hate it. Um, there's all different genres. Um, and I actually have uh, somebody that's helping me do with social media who's a, a very famous DJ in Ibiza. And she put together a playlist too and just we've got tons of music for you. So no matter what your taste is, I'm sure we've got you covered. I'm going to put this together in a blog post as well and post it on my website so that you can always come back to that as well. Um, but if you have this video shared on your wall, you'll always know where this one is. And then you can go, we'll, we'll put them here too in the video. Um, oh, the other thing that I want to say too is that over on Instagram, we're having a gratitude challenge. Um, I think we're like four or five days into it. Um, it's just been a really great way to um, like notice what I'm grateful for every day. Um, if you want some accountability there, we're posting every single day and um, you know, you can just type in the chat or type in the comments what you're grateful for as well. So if you want to join us over on Instagram, we'll put a link to that as well. It's Brittany Watkins tapping on Instagram. So if you don't follow me there, go ahead and, and follow us and join uh, the gratitude challenge because it's, it's really nice and, and it's, it's fun. And it's, there's very, we're, we're adding very uplifting um, messages as well. So it's not just one thing we're grateful for. Okay. Um, so I want everybody to take a nice deep breath. <laughs> Alana said, I just had a solo dance party this morning. Yes. Ugh, dance parties in my living room. It's like my new thing. I'm, I, I actually love these. This, I, I'm, I've really loved putting these playlists together because I've been discovering new music. Um, and I've discovered like this new genre of music that I really enjoy. So um, yeah, I can't wait to share that with you guys. Hope it helps. Um, okay, so let's start tapping. I'm gonna actually keep this one pretty short just so that you can come back to this and, and use it over and over again. So I don't wanna spend too much time talking today. All right, I want everybody to take a nice deep breath and tune into your body. And tune into your stress, your anxiety, your overwhelm. Just notice how you're feeling right now. And we're just gonna label all of this as stress right now. So I want you to give your stress level a, sorry, yeah, give your stress level a number on a scale from zero to 10. And start tapping the karate chop point and just follow along with me. Even though I'm feeling so stressed right now, I accept myself and how I feel. Even though I'm highly stressed right now, I accept myself and how I feel. Even though I have stress running through my entire nervous system, I accept myself and how I feel. All this stress running through my entire body, running through my entire nervous system. It's always there. Every day my body feels stressed. My body's on high alert. Everything is triggering me. Everywhere I look, I see danger. Every person I know is filled with fear. It's a really scary time. All this stress. I am so stressed.
I feel so stressed. I'm in a state of panic. And it feels really bad. Okay, take a nice deep breath. I'm going to repeat that sentence one more time, that paragraph one more time. Um, yeah, I'm feeling like we should go right into that again. So continue tapping through the points. All this stress. All this stress. Running through my entire body. Running through my entire nervous system. It's always there. Every day it's there. My body's on high alert. Everything is triggering me. Everywhere I look, I see danger. Oh good, I'm yawning. If you're yawning, that means you're calming down your nervous system. Every person I know is filled with fear. Tap slower too, I was forgetting to do that. It's a really scary time. All this stress. I am so stressed. I feel so stressed. And I keep getting triggered. This feels really bad. Okay, take a nice deep breath. Yeah, Valerie, I just yawned too. <laughs> All right, so tune back into your stress levels and notice what number you are on a scale from zero to 10 right now, okay? <sighs> I started at maybe a five and now I'm a two. If you want, um, type your number in the chat box and tell me what you started at and tell me what you're at now, please. Um, okay, keep tapping through the points, tuning into what's left. This remaining stress, it's not helpful. Every time I turn on the news, it's bad. And it's making me feel worse. And the cycle continues. All this stress. I'm getting triggered by everything. Bad news is coming from everywhere. It's working on me too, obviously. It's all adding to my stress. Remember to tap slowly, guys. There's so much I can't control right now. I feel so out of control. I feel so helpless. I keep getting triggered by everything. So I'm just gonna honor how I'm feeling. All right, take a nice deep breath or yawn. <laughs> I've got a really big yawn inside of me. <laughs> I'm tapping with, I'm tapping right along with you guys. <laughs> okay. Whew. 
going back in. I'm just going to honor my stress right now. It's warning me of potential danger. Thank you for trying to protect me. Thank you for warning me. Thank you for trying to keep me safe. But the truth is, I am safe. So I command my nervous system to relax. I'm gonna say that a few times. I command my nervous system to relax. <sighs> I command my nervous system to relax. I choose to feel calm in this moment. I choose to feel calm now. I choose to navigate this with clarity. I choose to find the good in this. and stay calm amidst the chaos. I choose to focus on my blessings and notice just how much I have to be grateful for. I can use this as an opportunity to notice the simple things I can be grateful for. I'm feeling much more relaxed now. It's safe to be relaxed. I can be safe and feel relaxed at the same time. All right, take a nice deep breath. Okay, and like I said before, if you want to come back to this video, tap on it every morning. Use this video to tap on every single morning if you're feeling stressed. It's going to really, really lower your cortisol and allow you to think clearly throughout the day. I would love for those of you that are on this video um, or if you're watching the replay later to type in something that you're grateful for, okay? Um, we're starting a gratitude challenge Oh yeah, and everybody tune into your stress levels on a scale from zero to 10. Tell me what you started with and tell me what you are right now, okay? If you're anything from like a three or above, just go ahead and start this video again from the beginning. Lana said, I'm down to a one. Carrie said, my nose is running like crazy. And Tina said, yeah, I'm yawning my head off too. Yeah, I always yawn. Elizabeth said, I yawn within 30 seconds, awesome. I started at a five and now I'm a one. Great, I'm so glad this is helpful. Um, let me know what you're grateful for. Um, today I am, I am grateful. God, there's so many things I'm grateful for. Um, I'm trying to articulate this. Even though this is a really shitty time and everybody's really stressed, I am so grateful for um, the ability to slow down and to notice all of the things that I take for granted. Um, just the other day, I was putting feta cheese on my salad and thinking, you know what? I don't know if the store is going to have more feta cheese for a while. And I just sat and savored it. Um, everything that I have right now, I'm just so grateful to have. And these are things that I typically take for granted every single day. I think I shared in one of the videos that I, I, you know, I cuss at Wi-Fi and social media a lot because, you know, it just runs our lives and it add, I feel like it adds to my stress, but I'm so grateful for this platform. I'm so grateful that we can all be connected still. Um, I'm so grateful that even in isolation, we can still connect, that we can still, I can still share this with you. I can still connect with my friends. I can still check in with my family. Um, and so I'm grateful for 
a lot of things that we take for granted on a daily basis. Uh, Lana says, I'm grateful for daily sessions with you all. <laughs> That's great. Valerie said, I'm grateful to know that I'm not alone. I'm grateful for the magic of the internet. Yes, absolutely. Um, Erica said, I'm grateful for you all. Thanks, you guys. Mine was anxiety rather than stress, and it worked beautifully. Yeah, so this will work for anything, any kind of stress or anxiety. Um, you know, that's that's why I did this. That's why I did sort of like a general tapping script today, so that no matter what you're feeling, you're feeling stressed, you're feeling anxious, you're feeling overwhelmed. It's all stress, right? So all these emotions are going to make you feel stressed, and you can come back to this video and just do this script over and over again. Um, and lower lower your cortisol levels and lower the anxiety, lower the, the uncertainty, lower um, all of the stress that, that you're experiencing. So um, thank you so much for being here. I'm grateful for springtime. Yes, me too. I started looking out of my window because the only space I have is these two little balconies and I'm noticing the trees um, have started to, to grow leaves and they've been growing. They've been getting bigger and bigger every single day. I've seen more and more leaves. And so I'm, I'm, I have never in my entire life noticed spring so clearly, you know, it, it feels like, um, you know, typically it's just like all of a sudden you notice, Oh, spring is here. Look at all the flowers. But like, I feel like I'm watching it in slow motion because that's really all that I have to do to look out to is I have these trees for my balcony and I'm just noticing every day how they're getting, um, how they're, they're blossoming. And it's, it's a really, it's just really beautiful to slow down and to notice those things because I feel like we don't notice those things regularly. We're so, so busy. And even though I feel busier than I've ever been, I've also really slowed down in a lot of ways to just notice the small things. So um, thank you all for being here. I hope you like this video and I hope it's helpful to you. Sending you lots of love.